10.5a, solving equations by factoring, the zero product rule. The zero product rule just states that if a times b equals zero, then either a equals zero or b equals zero. To solve, we set each factor equal to zero. So in our first example here, what we're going to do is we're going to set 5x minus 1 equal to zero and 2x plus 5 equal to zero. Now we solve for our variable. So here we'll add one to both sides. We get 5x equal to 1, divide by 5, and we get x equal to 1 fifth. Solve our other equation. We'll subtract 5 from both sides. We get 2x equal to negative 5, divide by 2, and we're going to get that x equals negative 5 halves, and we have solved our equation. In our second example, we're going to set each factor equal to 0, so that means 2x equals 0, therefore x has to equal 0. Think about it as what times 2 gives you 0, and the only thing possible is 0. We have x minus 6 equal to 0. Add 6 to both sides, and we get x is equal to 6. And then our 2x plus 3 equal to 0. Subtract 3. We have 2x equal to negative 3, divide by 2, and we're going to have that x equals negative 3 halves, 6, and 0.